Hello, Tokyo Tokyo Peepers, it is me, Favorite Creeper Ben, and I was doing this review on North Man's Wandering Souls by George Adamsinski. Adamsinski? Is that Adamsinski? I'm sorry, George, but you, you know, your last name hard for me. So, bring closer, bring closer, there we go. This was Twilight Zone Fuckery, and I mean it. Twilight Zone Fuckery, my brain, it melt. It melt because I was like, oh my god, where am I? What is this dimension? And then I was like, the nap demon was like, what the hell is this? It's Freddy Krueger, but it's like a goblin that turns into shit, and it turns into the girl's mother, which is really fucked up, because he's in bed with a beautiful woman. And then all of a sudden, he's in bed with his mom. It's so mad. Stop. And then there's a guy that can, like, has half his brain blown off in a gang thing, like, pfft. And then it was like, oh my god, I've lost half my head, but I can astral project into hospitals. <gasps> I was mad. And then they got Halloween closet, and then there was another one, which was about a writer who, who fell in love, you know, and, and I ended up. And another dimension with floating cigarettes and bourbon. Because, you know, floating cigarettes and bourbon. Who doesn't like that shit? But apparently he got bored of all the alcohol and coffee he could have. Anyway. I liked it. It was messed up. It was screwing with my brainage. And it made me think about a lot of things. Like, is this a reality of realness? My boyfriend is trapped in a room. He doesn't know if his reality is real. I don't know if this reality is real. Am I a real bunny? Am I a bunny at all? Or am I just a person I've trapped in a bunny's mind? Are you right there, creepy? No. I'm thinking into the void. Maybe we should just keep you on art for now. Sort of. It was awesome. I would do it again. In fact, I might re it because I'm starting to wonder if you're real. Of course I'm bloody real. I don't sure. You could be an imaginative figure of my imagination. <sighs> I'm pretty sure that the imaginative figment of the imagination is you. Why would you say that? Because talking teddy bear. Not a fucking teddy bear, the bitch. I'm a creepy bunny, and one of a kind. We can't get me anywhere. Nobody can. So sure.